Hello! Audio test, can you hear me? That's always the, the most important question, have I? First of all, unmuted my microphone. Second of all, is it at a good volume? Sound is good. Thank you very much, Erica. No. <laughs> Omni says no. And Khan says, I, I'm heard. Okay, I, I'm going to trust Erica and Khan, so. I can be heard. Fantastic. How are we all doing? Have we had a good two weeks? It has been two weeks since I streamed. Because I've been busy with King Gaff Creations work. We've been diligently working away at the most recent project, the Bard project. I think soon, maybe, we might be able to start showing things, previewing little snippets. It's good, says Gez. Thank you. <laughs> okay, my sound seems to be good. Fantastic. Thing is, though, because it's been two weeks, I, I can only vaguely remember where we left off. So uh, let's jump back into game and see where we were. Now, hopefully this works. We always have a, a tiny bit of uh, issues with games, but no, it looks like I'm in. It's on the right screen. Fantastic. Now, I think we were waiting for some of the vanilla quests to progress. Is there a doctor in the house? Wait for the medical lab upgrade to complete. And I think in the meantime, we were going to settlements and grabbing anyone who seemed to be free. And I do seem to remember one of them. We had to go return a holotape that we recorded. I don't think we did that. Uh... There we go. Return to Frenchie Jr. More than words. And also, we can meet with Lydia. So if we need to uh, kill more time, we can start the NLTC, which I do believe Gaffer just started playing on his stream. But, uh... Let's go return that holotape first, and uh, maybe then we can progress with the main story. I'm very curious to see how, with HQ Automation, that ties in with uh, Commonwealth Rising. Because you do have to do a few projects during that quest. Oh. Okay, apparently we don't have to wait. Once your HQ's been upgraded to support level 3 medical research, the science staff can begin developing vaccines and diseases. Okay. Okay, so we have to research a vaccine. We might as well do that now that we're here. Now, let's see if I can remember how to do this. Do we go to science? Research? Vaccines. 14 days. Oof. Okay. We've assigned that task. I'm hoping it doesn't take 14 days. That is, that's quite a while. I'm just going to put this over here. There we go. Wait for vaccine to research. Complete. Okay, so now, now we need to wait. So let's go. Let's go return that hull tape. Now, where was Frenchie? He was at Starlight. And maybe we should actually um, recruit some vanilla settlers, and not vanilla settlers, vanilla companions, so we can have some uh, mayors and start actually getting people to build up cities for us. Because we've been very lazy with that. And I'm using the uh, royal we, but I can blame you guys if you, if you want. Is that Frenchie? That is Frenchie. Hey, Frenchie! I hear Magnolia is as beautiful as ever, and that voice. Hi. Thank you kindly, stranger. This holotape means the world to me. And if you don't mind, I think I'll stick around here. Maybe sing a song at night. Okay, we have Frenchie. Now what are his stats? Because we can just send him to the HQ right away. So, uh, you can stay here. Do we have our clipboard? a lot better than New Reno. Hi there. Uh, work for me. What do you say? Want to work for me? Oh, not enough living space. Darn. Oh well. Well, we know he's here. And I think we just saw... I always miss it. That was by a laid-back ninja, I think, wrote that. Because uh, pretty much all of our settler characters were written by writers other than myself. I just want to oh. say, uh, you've done good. Uh, here's he's Dodge. But it looks like we finished researching that uh, vaccine. Yeah? What? <laughs> okay, Stodge is busy being mayor. Fantastic. 
Uh, let's, before we go back to HQ, let's uh, swing by Sanctuary. See if we've got any new people popping up over there. Renji has good charisma. So charisma is administration, right? Let's see, have <laughs> these guys been busy? Kind of. Mama Murphy does not have her chair because she has to work. I'm not seeing any random settler people. Hey, Sturgis is busy. Very good. <laughs> That's Preston. You ask me, freedom's always worth fighting for. Ahem. Need something? Okay, I guess we gotta go do some of those vanilla quests before we can get him as a companion. His daddy asks, do I have a favorite settler? Uh, do you mean vanilla base game settler or SS2 settler? You remind me oh. of a young and there's Piper. I used to know. Can I ask you something? Never looking for trouble, but always finding it. Did I make her the mayor here? I think I did. Never mind. I think maybe I did that just to build up this settlement, so I'm gonna bring her back with Got me. Got a minute. Um something Hold else. On. I'll be back. Okay, I think I just gotta put my clipboard away. Uh alien buster. Head my way? There we go. Sure, let's go. Will do. I'm not sure what happens to the settlement now that it's not going to move. Uh, Canuck asks, Starge just made a comment about the Vault City. Is he from back west? I don't recall. I think I know the line that you're referencing. Um, I think, if I remember, because I wrote that like two, three years ago, I think he's referencing sort of rumors. It isn't that he is from there. Could be wrong. I'd have to look through all of his miscellaneous dialogue. But I tend to... Whilst I do often in my notes write down like where a character's from, what their background is, so on and so forth, until it's actually spoken by them, I don't consider it canon. And that way we can... You know, we've got flexibility in case you want to change things. Uh, Kez says... SS2. Don't... Uh, I won't make you pick from the... In eh. I won't make you pick from the... Okay, I can't see that. It's covered by an emoji. I'm going to guess it says base game. Uh, base game. Non-interesting? Non-interesting base game ones. Haha. -ha. I don't know why uh, YouTube has decided that it's a great idea to put like a giant emoji over the text of the chat so I can't read what people say. Maybe they're expecting me to use uh, the sort of Streamlabs one, but uh, I prefer watching my... like uh, I prefer watching what you guys watch to make sure everything's fine. Uh, favorite SS2. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm not going to count any of the ones that I wrote because, yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I've got a bit of an ego, slightly. Uh, what's the term? Uh, begins with an N. No, 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 no. Uh, can't think of it. <laughs> but still, I'm not going to um, count my own stuff, because that's a bit, you know. So, um... Hmm. Oh, what is her name? Um, She shows up, and she has, like, a really sad story. Ah, oh, I can't remember her name. She's she's my favorite in terms of writing, though. Um, Doesn't seem like a great place to linger, Blue. Oh, I can't remember her name off the top of my head. I... I bet if I just say it's it's the lady who has the really, really sad story and is really well written, you guys might know who that is. She's my favorite. Uh, I think that I, I tripped over. I've not found her in any recent playthroughs. I'm not sure what it takes to spawn her. She might be a faction-specific one, maybe. Okay. Is that McCready? Hi, how nope, are you? the settler. <laughs> That's every female settler. They're all sad and have oh, had all of their, all of their family and, die. Well... I'd like to help you set up some better farms. You know what? I take it back. Joe, uh, whatever his name is, Ga Ga Gallagher. He he's my favorite NPC. Uh, sure. I'm interested. What is it you need? This might seem like an odd request at first, so before I ask it, I want you to consider what 200 years of radiation can do to soil. Mm. It works best if you picture the earth itself as alive and sick. As such, it can even reject the seeds we plant in it. That makes I've sense. poked around libraries when I've been able and found out the U.S. government actually prepared for this. 
They prepped seeds to be able to deal with radiation, spliced, uh, and even predicted some of the mutations we've come to rely on. I've managed to find out where they had a stash of these seeds stored away. If we retrieve them, we can increase the yields here. It might seem a little thing, but it's terrible important in the long run, and could change the game. Could I count on you? Okay. I'll do it. Good. Good. I have a key here. You'll be taking it to the safe in the Federal Ration stockpile. Bring them back to me and I will do the rest. Now, is that the place of the Raiders? Protect. Let's see. Boo, boo, boo. Boo, boo. We've got loads of quests we can do. Uh, special delivery? Hmm. Which quest was that? It ain't mean. Okay, there we go. Uh, sad story. Holly Specker. Wait, no. Odette, yes. There you go. It's Odette. Yeah, uh, that's the... Um, and sir. It's, it's interesting to come across the settler characters because I had nothing to do with them in terms of writing. They were before my time. I had nothing to do with them in terms of implementation. So I get to see new things in SS2 that I... I'm surprised by it. It's a new experience for me, and that's fun. And hers was one that I thought was just really, really well done. I appreciated that one. Yeah, uh, I see. <laughs> okay, the chat agrees. I think that's my favorite NPC. What was that sound? Someone's fighting out there. Okay, so our quest are taking us over here, over here. Okay, okay, well, okay, that was a good placement to get those seeds. And uh, we're right, right close to it. I wonder if Joe is uh, scripted to turn up here, or if that is just a a very nice happenstance that he happens to be right where, <laughs> where next to right where we need to go. It's very nice of him. But if this is uh, the place I'm thinking of, I have earmarked that location to be where a uh, potential future quest is going to take place. Involving a certain someone wearing certain power armor, wielding a certain large weapon. <sighs> we'll see when we get there. If it's uh, if it is the place I'm thinking of, I will recognize it when I see it. And it's okay if we use a, uh, a location for multiple quests. I don't think it would any way contradict what I plan to do with that location. Because we tend to try and reset cells, um, like, um, like, uh, what you call it? Satellite Station Olivia. Like, we're meant to reset that cell, it doesn't always work with that door locking again. Uh, especially early on. So Jake would be like, hey, let me get this door open. Uh oh, you're white, safe, safe, safe. And the door's just already open because, uh, we happened to be here before. Now that is something, uh... That was, uh, let's just shoot this guy in the head. That is something I accounted for in the writing, where uh, Jake's... Uh, okay, I've been playing Helldivers too much. I just tried to leap out the way of that thing. Uh, let's just shoot it. Uh, because Jake will mention that it looks like someone's been tampering with the security, and that is meant to be a, a hand wave in case the player hasn't been here before. Let's get that meat. Or it could just be that one of the raiders has been doing it. But obviously that means that the door has to reseal itself. Okay, seeds. This way. So we may have to do uh, something similar with this location. If the player has already been there. It's, it's an interesting challenge as far as... Um... Hmm, this doesn't seem right. Uh, it's an interesting challenge in terms of uh, game design. How do you... How do you stop a player exploring areas you're going to use for a quest later on? But also give them freedom to go wherever the hell they want. Ooh, hello. Organic materials. Okay, this is the place I think I was thinking of. Okay, we have a machine gun. That apparently I'm looking behind me <laughs> to target. I'm not seeing any radars. Why am I looking over here? The machine gun is over there. I'm going to shoot it, though. Uh, uh. I miss? 
Have I not got range? Okay, let's switch to something with, uh, with more range. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. This has range. No idea why I'm looking behind me. Okay, that's going to be bugged, right? Because I target it, and it thinks it's over here. And I shoot it, and it's doing no damage. Okay, but there are Raiders, so this is where I was thinking of. Piper, help me out here. And I missed. Damn it. Okay, where... Oh. It's too foggy, I can't see. Okay, I'm just going to get my shotgun out. Where's that shotgun? There it is. Oh, oh, no, it shoots me. Was that you? And I can target it now. Okay. That's weird. So, uh, oh. oh. I don't want to kill the dog, but I have to. Uh oh. Okay. Uh, hmm. I might run away. Uh, I might just run away over here for a bit. Okay, I think Piper's keeping them busy. That's a. Uh, Oh. oh, I have to get a little bit of... Oh, well, we're dead anyway. Never mind. Okay. We're, we're going to approach this in a different way. Right, so, catch up with chat. The seeds are in the federal uh, Russian stockpile back door at the nearby church. Is that where we were? Were we? Were we? Oh, we're all the way back here. Okay, we're going to run this way. Uh, the back door, more stealthy option. Tiny church up has a hatch. Oh, right. I think I know where you're talking about. Ah, bah, 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 bah. Gotta find the church. There it is! Okay, yes. Okay, the bear seems... Okay, it is interested in us, so let's, uh... Let's deal with that first. We'll get it. Let it get a tiny bit closer, just so we've got a better chance of uh, blowing its head off. That's fine. 75, 84, 93. And we missed it. Twice. <laughs> Slightly better. Let's cheese it. Oh. And it still got us. Jump. Uh, we're out of action points. Ooh, I forgot this thing has a legendary effect. Okay, organics. We've got less than that. Ow. Okay, we've got some action points. We can get this guy. There we go. That wasn't elegant, but it worked. Ours now. And let's heal. I always get told off for doing it this way. But it's a, a holdover from using mods that add different aid items. So uh, I don't always want to use a stim pack normally in uh, normal gameplay for me. Uh, blah, blah, blah. I wouldn't worry much about reusing locations as long as the main. As long as it's not the main quest. Old Paul's funeral took you to the same place as Odette's. Oh, old home. I did not know that. Yeah, there's, we definitely reuse locations. Uh, unintentionally sometimes, because, as I was saying before, I didn't have anything to do with the with the old settlers. So uh, their writing is often a surprise to me, which is fun. I can't remember if there are raiders in here. Apparently not. Fantastic. Is there mines? No. Ah, secret entrance. Okay. We're going to save. I'm gonna sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Yeah, I've definitely been playing uh, too much Hell Divers. <laughs> I was like, oh, this is easy. I can just let the bear run at me and I can just dive to the side and shoot it. Nope. You can't do that in a Fallout game, sadly. Until maybe we get Fallout 5. Assuming they switch engines. Hey. Oh, they might. Oh. Yeah, let's shoot this uh, friendly little guy. And miss. Oh, and I'm out of ammo. Back to the alien blaster. Shoot this guy. 
or not. <laughs> we'll shoot this friendly person. Grenade got thrown at me. I don't know where that went. Superior technology. Oop. Where's that coming from? Over there. Okay, we're gonna save. I don't wanna do that again. Yep. Ah, I missed. Okay, there it is. Okay, we're good. Okay, password, that seems useful. Weapon, I seem to recall there is loot in here. Let's see. Some tasty jets, some food. More food. Ah, perfect. Okay, that's useful. Oh, I remember. So I think uh, a group of uh, raiders has kidnapped this raider's sister and was holding her hostage, but really she was already dead. Oop. Okay. Let's sneak. Sneaky, sneaky, sneak. No one knows we're here. Ah, okay. <laughs> I like how that just spawned in. Okay, we have the seeds. That look surprisingly a lot like a weapon mod. No, come on, Piper, we don't need to fight them. Come on. What the fuck was that? It was nothing. Nothing there. Nothing there. We're just going to leave, and no one will know we're here. Good suggestion coming in through the church. And... Fantastic. But I think we still need to make space at the HQ for more workers, annoyingly. Okay. Do we have any more quests? Nope, just return there. Uh, hmm. Uh, let's reactivate that relay tower whilst we're near. I don't think we've done any of those yet. And I, considering we've been ignoring pretty much anything outside of the main story for SS2, I've almost certainly not done any of the side quests that the uh, radio towers point to. So uh, the radio towers are obviously a vanilla game thing. Oh! He was pretending to sleep. Get him. Well, that makes no sense. Oh. I, I used a melee attack and that atomized him for some reason. Oh. I gotta love this weapon. Ooh, I want, I want those caps. Gimme. There we go. They don't hurt me. Uh, the seeds uh, look like tiny bullets. It's ammo for a pea shooter. Ah, we've been tricked. Nom nom nom, nom nom nom, nom nom nom. All better. I didn't need to use a single stim pack. Oh, now this isn't a. Uh, no, okay. I thought uh, we were going up there, and I'm fairly sure that's where the Tomaton Raiders are. I forget what they're called. Originally, I think it was just a satellite station, and there was nothing really there. But with the DLC, they sort of... Oh, ah, 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 ah. Everything's still attached? Okay, we're going to use a sim back now, because I probably hurt my legs. Uh, but now it's... Uh... It's like a, it's got a sub basement. Oh, oh my! I thought those are active mines. Okay, fun loot. 
But no, it looks like uh, we are going just here, so we don't have to go fight a bunch of raiders right now, which I am not interested in. Rust Devils, that's what they're called, thank you. Okay. Let's turn this thing on. There's no oil that's going to set on fire. Fantastic. Ooh, something I've just thought of, actually. I don't know what happens if you don't complete this quest and a certain someone is uh, not around anymore. So uh, I'm, not, I'm not sure we've ever actually taken that into account, so we may have to uh, make these quests fail if you've not done them uh, by that point. And of course, I'm speaking of Jake. Jake can, uh, can disappear or be killed. And uh, it's always him and sometimes Lupe speaking to us on these quests. So uh, if either of those do disappear... These quests will have to not work anymore. I mean, I guess you could still do the quests. Uh, you're just not going to get any feedback from them. Okay. Relay tower picked up and patched into our network. Let's see. That should be 0BB915. Good job. That's the first tower active. Hmm. Picking up a signal. Huh. Looks like we got an entrepreneur on the airwaves. Some chem pusher by the sounds of it. I'm sure I don't have to tell you to stay away from shady fellas selling cams. But I'm not your daddy. You do what you want. One down, five more to go. Good luck. Is that Piper over there fighting someone? Okay, I think we've done everything in the uh, local area. Uh, oh, maybe we should travel to Oberland. And, uh, I, I don't think that was a, a Minuteman location, but we do have a relay tower nearby, so might as well do it. Excuse me. You've got to help. My sister's been kidnapped. <gasps> It's okay. You just need to tell me what happened. They said they'd be back for the ransom in a few days. If I don't pay up, they'll kill her. But I don't have that kind of money. How lazy are we feeling? Hmm. Here's the ransom. Pretty really lazy. Pay yep. them when they come back. Uh oh, okay, thanks. I just hope I can trust those raiders to keep their promise. We did it! We saved the day! And then I think this uh, counts as uh, us helping them. So now uh, Preston should be happy with this. Seems to be growing well. well. Take some taters. These are our taters now. I mean, we did just pay a lot of caps. Nom, 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 nom. Delicious taters. Okay, now we have a relay tower over here. Oh, yes. Jake is not your daddy. Are we way down? Have I uh, grabbed too many things? Yeah, darn. Okay, let's, uh... Oh, that's a lot of taters. No, 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 no. Where's Piper? Hey. Just let me... Okay, I've already got a... Carrying a bunch of junk. Um... No. That'll do for now. Where is this tower? There it is. Are there any nasty creatures around it? Uh, so we'll do this, we will deliver back those seeds, maybe check in with Preston. Although I think uh, that wasn't what he currently wanted us to do. Oh no, Mala. <laughs> Zerik is a big fan of potatoes. Who, who doesn't like potatoes? Potatoes are great. Where's Jake? Relay Tower 1DL109 added to the network and fully operational. Getting some chatter coming in. Hard to make out, but sounds like a few distress signals are being picked up. But what is... I don't... Hey, hey Lupe, can you boost this? Sure, can do. Uh, is it now? Yeah, yeah, I, I don't quite know what I'm listening to here, but... I don't know what this is, but some of my strangers nearby you. It's broadcasting some weird stuff. 
If you investigate, be careful. Keep up the good work. Talk again soon. Hmm. Is the alien signal still broadcasting? Nope, that's a human. I think we turned that off. Okay, that might be a, a polish thing. I think uh, Jake is commenting on the alien signal, though. Are we near the crash sites? Uh, yeah, okay, we're not too far from it. It's around here somewhere, I think. So technically speaking, uh, that should be conditioned off at this point, and uh, he should move on to talking about something else. Because I think I turned that radio off when I did that quest. Okay, nothing else local. Let's uh, return to Sunshine. And where is that fella? What was his name? Joe? Joey? There he is. Hey there. I can see it in your eyes. You have something for me. The seeds, yes? Tell me you've managed to get them. Here you go. Here they are indeed. Such a terrible small thing. But locked inside is the power to change the world. Now we just have to get these to the earth and coax out what lies within. I'd say thank you, but I don't think that says how much you did here. <laughs> here you are healing the world. <laughs> I think I'll say thank you by sowing these and bringing you the yield. Thank you. Now I'll take those off your hands and we can get started growing more and better food for your people. A terrible good end to the tale, I think. Okay, we're at Sunshine, so you go to Sunshine. Not awful quiet in here. There's the the credits. Voice actor and writer. Oh, we got an advanced farm. Those are pretty good. How much food are we making here? Not much. Let's put down... Or can we change it to one of these to an advanced farm? Is this an advanced farm? It looks... It looks kind of advanced. Where's the uh, ASAP? Ooh, some special people with varieties. Purple. Okay, I did not read that. Beauty Tales. This is a standard large tater farm. And it is level 3. Seems a shame to tear that down. Let's... Uh, I think we've got at least one ASAP on us, hopefully. Oh, we have four. I want to build a big farm. But where can we build it? Hmm, maybe here? Boop, 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 boop. Uh, there we go. Where's that ASM? Do we need to tell it to be an advanced farm? Advanced farm. I don't care what kind. Uh, B -b -b -b. Yeah, use that option. Now, where is... Where'd Joe go? There he is. We want to assign him to it. Because I can only assume he's a... Good farmer guy. Where are you going, Joe? Why can't I select him? Hmm. Wait, did, oh, that's not... <laughs> that's not him. <laughs> I was looking at... It looks like him. He's got the same color hair. He's wearing the same color outfit. Okay, that that's why I can't select him. But where is he? Uh, Canuck says, Usually a level 1 advanced farm makes more stuff than a basic level 3. This is true. But I've got a sunk cost fallacy playing where it's like, well, I'm already leveled up to level 3. Okay, there he is. I can do that. Fantastic. That is his farm now. This place will make lots of food. The HQ should be happy. Speaking of, let's return and see... 
There we are. Let's see what's happening there, because I think we finished researching that vaccine while we are gone. It does feel such a shame to be rushing through the whole settlement interaction and building thing, because I really do enjoy that. But that's not what I'm here to do. Speaking of, what am I meant to be doing here? Speak to Cassandra. Okay. Where is Cassandra? There she is. Looking at questionable things. Message for any available hmm. logistics. Ah, there you are. The flu has been banished from our little noisy. fortress, and our gentle Lupe has been kind enough to get the vaccines out to the surrounding settlements. That's one illness you'll see much less of out there. That fact alone is a massive step for the common good. Ah, I find tangible progress refreshing. I look forward to whatever comes next. You've done good work. We should be all thanking you <laughs> for making this possible. Machine. Not the other way around. But still, your words are appreciated. Okay. We did it. Expertise on available materials needed. Next quest. Next quest. Is it gonna go? Uh, Kes says, uh, you can do what you want. Make us sit through what you want. No, this is... This playthrough is, is for you guys. Once I'm done with this playthrough, then it's what I want to do. <laughs> and I don't know what that is yet. Oh, we unlocked. Clinical infirmary and ER infirmary. Room layouts, okay. Yes? Thank you. It's like I can finally think straight. Let's see, uh... Let's see what's going on here. Okay, it looks like we're low on power. Hmm. Facilities, clean up construction, maintenance, repair. I'm fairly sure... Hmm. Now, did we make generators, or... Is that part of one of the future quests? I cannot recall. Hmm. Come off rising. Start computer network upgrade project from engineering department in command mode. Did we speak to Jake last time? Did he tell us to huh? do that? I vaguely remember maybe. Because I guess uh, Commonwealth Rising and is there a doctor in the house can run at the same time? Hmm, maybe. Where's Jake? Why is he not busy working? Lazy. Anton being sneaky in Jake's room. There's Jake, wrapped up in uh in that rug. Yeah, I think this is Lupe's room. Oh I knew you would help us. I wonder how many people have deserted since I was last here. That does seem to be a thing that likes to happen. And then we discover them out and about during our adventures. There's Mansfield looking for. Oh right, everyone's bugged and around the table. Hey. Hey. Glad we got some more bathrooms installed. The lines were starting to get ridiculous. Never mind. Okay. Okay. So we must have talked to Jake last time. I just don't remember. Start the computer network upgrade project from engineering department in command mode. Okay, engineering department. We can do that. We can do that. Engineering. Upgrades. Computer network. Okay. We'll allow that to run whilst we're away. And I'm going to assume automation fully takes care of that. Wait for it to complete. In the meantime, let's go do more things. So we have a relay tower over there. Another over there. Get rid of that now. Ooh. No, I want to... Gosh darn it. Remove it. There we go. Um, we can meet with Lydia. Another relay tower. Help ten... 
Pines Bluff. I think that is the quest that Preston wants us to do. So uh, I'm going to check in with him first at Sanctuary and just see if uh, that whole paying off the Raiders thing was part of his quest or was unrelated. I'm not sure. I have no idea why those guys are stuck in the meeting room, though. Like, surely they should be uh, not doing that anymore. Maybe they just need a script to kick them out of sitting in the chair. Hmm. Test my luck, do I feel lucky? You know what? Oh, I thought we could interact with these. Maybe that's uh, something we had to cut. I seem to recall roughly at some point... Ooh, power engineering. Oh, well that finished pretty quickly. Okay, okay, okay. I should be reading these probably, but power transfer. Okay, that's that's what we want to start sending uh, power to the HQ. And I completely forgot what I was talking about. Oh yeah, the uh, those gambling machines. I'm fairly sure at some point we did plan to have those be usable. I'm not sure if there was a complication. You call with this them. place sanctuary. Cemetery seems a little more appropriate. There's McCready. Sanctuary. But apparently we can't assign as a mayor. Where's Preston? He should be marching up and down this road, surely? What? Another settlement needs my help. Oh, they always need my help. <laughs> Where's Preston? I'm curious whether he's going to acknowledge us taking that settlement that we just uh, helped secure. Hmm. I'm just going to wait here for now. Oh, I can't do that in this game. <laughs> That's Skyrim. Gotta find something to sit on. Although I do think I have a mod that allows me to do that, but I can't remember what the quick key is, so uh, we'll just sit here. Preston might be walking by the river. Hmm. He might be. We'll wait an hour, see what happens. See if he pops into existence. And if not, we will track him down. Hey, Mama Murphy. Preston isn't over there. We'll check by the river, and then uh, we'll head... Oh, there he is. Stay sharp. Don't let your guard down. Hi. The Minutemen could use someone nope. like you. Okay, he is not interested that we just help those guys out. So, uh... We will go to Ten Pines. And then we'll reactivate that tower. And then we'll head back to the HQ. Although shortly, I, I may pause to get a drink. I'm quite thirsty. I, I had, uh partaken in the hydration before I started streaming, but uh, generally speaking, I'm a very thirsty person. I almost always have a, a glass right next to me, filled. Big glass as well, not those tiny glasses. Can't have those. Ba -ba -ba. Boop. Okay, where are we heading? This way. I'm so used not to checking the uh, compass. That's a habit I've got to break. Run, run, run. Oh my. Okay, they're fighting each other. I don't want to kill the dog. Oh, didn't have to. Okay, here's where we want to go. And what's the betting? They want us to go help out another settlement or kill some raiders. How many caps do we have? Oh, not many. <laughs> so I can't just pay them off. Damn. What do you want? We don't need any more trouble around here. It's okay. I'm with the Minutemen. I'm here to help. You're with the Minutemen? I didn't really think you fellas still existed. We sent word with one of them passing traders. But honestly, I never expected anything to come of it. Most people don't put much stock in the Minutemen these days. Mm -hmm. After Quincy. We're rebuilding the Minutemen from the ground up. Glad to hear it. 
No question that things have been worse since the Minutemen fell to pieces. What do There's you a raiding want? gang that's been giving us okay. trouble for weeks. Stealing food and supplies. Threatening to kill us all if we don't pony up. We know where they're coming from, but we can't go up against a gang like that. Don't worry. I'll take care of those raiders for you. Thanks, friend. Oh, it's if called Vega. Time, <laughs> that's just going to be a pain to clear out. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, no, I can't steal the teachers because I'm, I'm almost weighed down as it is. So stealing them won't do me. What are you doing over there? Didn't even kill it. My advanced alien technology, not enough. Ah. I guess we showed them. All right, still in one piece. Shouldn't these guys have names? Like I'm fairly sure there might be something tempine, right? Are these like replacement NPCs? Did the tempine guys die? They look the same. I think. I'm not seeing any bodies around. Oh. Hey, you hearing me? We just finished work on the network upgrade. You know, connecting all the computers. This will all make my work a lot easier, so... Just wanted to say thanks. Just doing my job. Can the humility and take the damn compliment, will you? I don't go around thanking just anyone, you know? Look, the point I want to make is, I'm glad our computers are better. We can all get a lot more work done now. Oh, and we've set you up a personal terminal in your quarters, too. So, make sure you check it out. And, uh, if you could get a crew to fix up our generators, too, stabilize our power a little bit, that would be great. All right. See you later, fancy pants. Okay. I don't know if you can do those two projects at the same time. Maybe you can. Okay, we'll go get that tower, and then we'll head back to the HQ and start the uh, project on the generators. I, th I swear we did that. Just, no? Like, we got that update saying that we can uh, transfer power now, or was that just completely unrelated? This shows how good my memory is. I can't even remember something we did just ten minutes ago. Uh, Connect says, uh, Most rename mods name them something tempines. Uh, but they are unnamed in vanilla. Ah, okay. Like the father and son at the country crossing. Ah, see that again. This shows how often I play with mods that I can't even remember what the base game vanilla content is like. So sometimes, <laughs> can I leave? Can I just walk away. Okay, didn't notice me. Uh, we'll just leave. I don't want to shoot the doggy. We are heading in the right direction. Fantastic. Oh, you can heal the dog? Oh, I'm running back there then. Okay. I've never encountered this uh, random encounter before. Growl. Easy there, girl. I can fix you up. Help, dog. Here. This will make you feel better. <laughs> Is this vanilla content? You're just as ugly as ever, buttface. It's gotta be. Because those are lines I've not heard before. Is that it? I, I want to send buttface to a settlement. Ah, you can name her and she'll show up again. Uh, but you can't send her to a settlement. Oh, well, she's called buttface now. Blue. Aww. Good doggy. Yeah, I've never had that uh, random encounter either, Kes. That's a brand new one to me. And I would have thought that's like a mod introduced one if we didn't have those player lines. Aw, oh, poor butt face. She can't help it. Oh, that's nice. I, I'm always sad when I have to kill the dogs, and there was a nice, happy, friendly one. Ooh, it's quite a... Why at the distance? I thought it was closer... Closer than that. Uh, oh, no, okay. I don't want to attack that one. We're going to keep running. 
There we go, okay. That definitely was a hostile dog. Grab, grab, grab. Oh, no. Okay, we've got the rebreather. Swimming isn't that big of a deal. But we do have a blowfly. Let's, uh... Let's deal with that. Yeah. Stay still. Yes, ah. this is it. Yeah. Bam. Alien go? technology to kill small... Okay, large insects. Okay, let's deal with this one. Bam. Okay, I was hoping to get at least two hits off on it. Okay, that'll do. And then we're going to use... The legendary in that one, once it heals. Who's throwing those things? There we go, okay. Aim for the head, and... Oh, well that didn't do as much as I hoped. Piper, help me! Who is... Oh, it's because I gave her Molotovs. It is Piper throwing those. Piper! Man, I've got a load of action points. Although I keep missing, so... Haha. <laughs> You can't possibly follow me down there. Yeah. Unexpected. What have you got? Ooh, a freezing hunting rifle. Just going to waste otherwise. Okay. Must be. Yep, there it is. Okay. Swim, swim, swim. Hmm. That still seems like a lot of rats, unless one of my mods is active that makes a lot more rats. A whole bunch of you, aren't there? Oh, For not now. more. Okay, we're gonna save. I'm oh, definitely gonna save. Beep, 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 beep. Fantastic. Okay. And let's heal up before we move on. Step back. Ah. Okay, let's quickly test how many rats I get with the rebreather off. Uh, apparel. Rebreather. Okay, so at least half soon. That's pretty good, I guess. I think at some point it was uh, much more overpowered, maybe. And we've turned that down. I'm going to be sad when my alien blaster <laughs> runs out of ammo. Okay, is this the one with either... One of them has the insects that try and kill you. Hey. One of them has the fire. Okay, this is the insects. Still in one piece. There we go. No fire? No, no fire. I always get caught out by the one that has oil on the ground and that it, it ignites the oil when you uh, extend the dishes. But not this time. See, I'll forget. By the time I find that one, I'll have forgotten that that happens and it will catch me out again. Uh, Nick asks, is this version 3.3.1? Um, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> it depends how recent that version is. Looks like you've got Tower 3 SMU81 online. Nicely done. At the halfway point now. That's three. Getting some chatter coming in. Hard to make out, but sounds like a few distress signals are being picked up. Up to you if you want to look into that or not. Either way, this tower's now a part of our network. All right, see you later. Over and out. Yay. Uh, Lake Q was a rad dumping ground bef uh, before. Bad news for the fishing competition. <laughs> Oh, good news. Big fish. Okay, let's uh, head back to the HQ and set the next project going. 
and it looks like they, they handle themselves quite well with the automation. I'm going to assume that's what's happening. Uh, could always use the console to add more ammo, but then Cassandra made it. We could. Um, that might be actually a good idea for a project at some point. Spend resources, get more ammunition. Okay. So the next project was improve the the generators. Power station upgrade? Is that it? I'm going to assume it's this. Just going to have a think about it. Did I do the right thing? Cassandra? Ah, it does smell better out here. Hmm. Maybe not the right thing. Okay, I think we did do that. Uh, use supply agreements in the HQ and uh, power transfer plot sense. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, so agreements. That will be under. Oh, fire! Do we have an extinguisher? I'm not sure. I think. Did we grab it from the storage? Uh, simple storage? Nope, that's just my fat man I put in there. Miscellaneous, mods, fire weapons. Hmm. Where do we get the fire extinguisher from? I don't know. I'm gonna let the HQ staff deal with that because I don't know where the extinguisher is. Okay, uh, so let's see. Up engineering. Upgrades. Living quarter, fire escapes, crew rooms. Okay, I think we assigned the thing. Allow PA system to broadcast radio. Ooh, that's a good thing. Let's, let's get that built. Uh, bu okay, so we want to go to admin? Or is it logistics? Uh, let's catch up with chats. Uh, you can change the blaster to energy cells. Is that base game or is that a mod though? I'm sure, I'm sure Cassandra would love to tinker with alien tech. That is something we discussed at a certain point of having a quest line that involved aliens in a way. Uh, but it was quickly brought up, and I'm not talking about the alien ghoul, this is a, a different thing. Um, but it was brought up very quickly of like, if we introduce aliens and alien tech, then surely Cassandra and Jake and, and Lupe, they'd be very interested and want to integrate this alien technology. And that's a big game changer. So the safest option was just, we have to ignore it. We just pretend there isn't alien technology, despite the fact there's an alien right there, and we can just bring it back to the HQ and dissect it and tinker with its technology and reverse engineer it. Maybe in the future we'll uh, cover that. Uh, Nick Garza asks, am I looking forward to Fallout London? Yes and no. So something that's happened with so many big mod projects is they never quite make it to release. Or oh, they do make it to release, but then there's, you know, they're, they're not quite what we anticipated, or there's a lot of problems with them. These are things I worried about with Fallout London, but it seems it might be one of those rare mods that actually does everything it set out to do, and does it good and right, and isn't going to mess anything up. So my fingers are crossed, and I hope it's good, but I'm not getting my hopes up. Despite the fact that I know quite a few people who work on it, and they're all very good, so... Again, my hopes should be up, but I've been let down before, so I'm cautiously optimistic. Uh, pretty sure there's an extinguisher by the elevator. Hmm, let's see. Not worrying about that furry music. Well, I didn't know it was furry music until you told me that. And if no one else knows it's furry music, then I'm, I'm guessing that's okay and they can get away with it. Okay, near this elevator? Or a different elevator? Hello, Cassandra. No extinguishers in here, huh? Hmm. <laughs> okay, let's uh let's go back to trying to get that agreement going. Logistics, manage, coordinate, execute, coordinate. An announcement from the admin team. As one of our hmm. 
Spy agreement established spy agreement, seven spy agreement. So I'm guessing we just set up a regular supply agreement to somewhere that has excess electricity. Okay, let's say Oberlin Station. So we just need to uh, create some excess power somewhere. Did we recruit someone who does that? Or was that on a different playthrough I did? I know there's an NPC who's like, hey, I uh, I used to make pre-war power. That's Archon, I think. Okay, I don't think we've recruited Archon yet. Like, he, he did something related to power pre-war or something, and he promises he he, he will uh, give you more power somehow. I think it maybe unlocks a custom plot. Let's see. Cleansing, Tempires, Kill Raiders, Move Lydia, Great to the Relays, Supply Agreement. Okay, so... Use supply agreements in the HQ and power transfer plots and settlements to increase settlement to 1,000. Hmm. So I know we have someone hanging out. We have, um... Uh, Cersei, I think, hanging out in Hangman's Alley over there. We have our farmers at Sunshine. We have Starlight doing nothing good. Okay, we do need another mayor if we're going to set up a town properly, so... We can go clear out Covega and make Preston happy. Now, I think he becomes a follower just prior to retaking the castle. Could be wrong about that. We could... Maybe go grab Curie? I don't think we've got Curie yet. And we have been to Vault 81. But I don't think we've uh, done anything since uh, the kid got ill. That seems faster than dealing with Preston, so let's go... Let's go grab Curie and make her a mayor somewhere. Because uh, I don't remember him unlocking hey, a unique Chief. plot. Oh. Fiona from the Nightingales is at HQ asking to see you. It seemed urgent. Something about a missing person. She's waiting in the meeting room. That was all. Oh. I think we could get a uh, follower. But I don't think a particular follower that we can just get now. I don't think he can be made into a mayor. Sadly. Uh, so that's the Raphael quest, I think. We can go uh, rescue him and make him a follower character. Uh, strong is easy to get. Easy to get than Curie. Yeah, but won't we have to kill a bunch of super mutants? Don't try anything. Hmm. Um, hmm. No one's mentioning anything about this. Yes. <clears throat> Watch out for the maintenance. It never ends around here. Let's go investigate. Remember, no funny business. I'm still annoyed that uh, McCready refuses to be a, uh, a mayor. I guess maybe we could do the trick again of use Piper just to get her to set the place up. <laughs> Better than a fuck ton of mole rats. Uh, it depends if we get bit or not. I know um, in vanilla game, if your companion gets bit, then you get the disease still. I have no idea if that was ever fixed. Welcome or, uh, back. Nice to see the Commonwealth hasn't got. I think that was something yet. only mods fixed. So you have to like uh, tell your companion to wait behind you. Okay. You there? How would you like to do Vault Eighty One a favor and possibly save my boy's life? Go on. I would be glad to help. I was hoping I could count on you. Bobby here will show you where he keeps his secret stash. There is a chance that somewhere in there is a cure for Austin. If you find it, bring it to Dr. Forsyth. And for Austin's sake, please hurry. <laughs> okay, I think uh, at some point we came back to grab the Biotomatic and maybe they were having that conversation and we just ignored them. The work never ends in Vault 81. So they've just been wandering around waiting for me to come back. Is that Bobby? Hey, how's it going? It'd always be better. Hey, Bobby. Come on. Let's go. Okay. I guess he heard us having this conversation. Man, it just shows that even the base game has some weird jank. Like, uh, we, we go out of our way to avoid having situations like that where, like, like, why is Bobby here? How did he hear us having that talk? But obviously the base game assumes that you just overheard everything in the medbay and that Bobby was there and that you didn't walk away. But obviously we did. Hey, Bobby. 
And now he's got nothing to say. Okay, let's, uh, let's get rid of some of those rats we got. Uh, aid right away. And, uh, where's Piper? Can we tell her to stay hey. here? Where to? Wait there. Okay, I'll be here then. And is she gonna stay right there? That's the question. Okay, save. I'm fairly sure we can uh, heal the Morat disease with uh, a cure at the HQ. So, if we do contract it, oops, it's not the worst thing in the world. I'm just, I'm just waiting for them to burst out, try and catch me unaware. Okay, we're good so far. Oop. Bam. I'm thinking this place doesn't um level up with you. So maybe uh when this quest starts, it sets the level of everything because those were easy to shoot. <coughs> Yeah, level five. Quite low, all things considered. No. Yeah. Ba -ba -ba. Uh, Tan says, I missed a few streams. Have we done any of the free point free zero quests yet? Uh, would that be a particular funeral for a particular person? If so, no. We have not done that quest yet. I do not think it has been triggered. I think. Okay, no more rats. Oh my. Okay, <laughs> looks like we got a... One of my textures in my texture pack is not working properly, so this place looks very crispy. Oh. Bam. And that's a... There we go, let's heal myself up. Okay, now... I think we can activate that Protectron to help us. I'm just going to brute force it as always because I'm lazy. Let's get it like that, get it like that. Is it rad? Nope. I really should just read these things. But I don't want to. Uh, nope. Man, we're getting very unlucky with these. Got it. There we go. Activate. Now, is it going to attack us? Powering up. Protectron on duty. Yeah, look, yeah look, those walls are scary. We're just not gonna... We're not gonna pay attention to them. I'm gonna walk very slowly behind our new friend. Protect and serve. Come on. A legendary. Ooh, no, that's not what I want to press. I want to press that. Level 14. I, I can't be bothered waiting for our friend to catch up. I'll just run back if more rats appear. Bam. Okay, is that just a dead mole rat? Is that a broken animation mole rat? It's a dead mole rat. Okay. Is that a dead mole rat? No. That's a dead mole rat. Are there, are there any more like that? I'm just going to climb up here where it's safe. Bam. Okay, we're doing fine so far. I don't think that one bit us. Oh! Oh, okay, we've been bitten. Eh, we'll just have Cassandra cure us. Now, do I have that Actually, disease now? Uh, where is it? So your stats. Uh, is it a perk? Status. Okay, more right disease. We're diseased. We have to do what we can for Austin. So usually, if I was actually playing for, for Zeus, 
I just reload my save because I just failed. Oh, well, this is gonna be a choice for you. You get to nag me and I can't go anywhere. A real nice hold. Make this about you and your staff are to make sure every resident remains yeah. under stringent medical observation. Understood. Where are those stinking no rats? No buts. This is for the good. Well. Imagine a Fallout game without bats. Madness. Can we close this? Nope. Okay, that door's open forever. They so angry. Bam. I seem to remember you have to kill like the the brood mother for some reason, but I don't know why. Like, does she have a key on her or something? coming out of this room. Okay, okay. Oh. Is there a key somewhere I'm meant to grab? There's a mini nuke apparently. Ah, that's it. It's the password I need. Ah, oh, carrying too much. But I don't want to leave behind my things. I'll just put it on Curie once we grab her. Oh, I'm so tired. Oh, but we're so close to Curie. Okay. Password input. Oh, did it not open it? Please wait, please wait. There we go. Open door. Now we can leave. Oh, I'm so slow. I sure hope those mole rats don't follow me and try to kill me. Hey, Curie. I detect intruders. Please oh. neutralize them. You know what? I'm not going back there. You've returned. Are you Void Tech Security? I've waited so very patiently for you to arrive. I'm not role playing. Yes, I'm security. Yes. Y yes, I am. Superb! I placed an emergency call so long ago. I was. I like the lines where you deny your security, and she's like, I "No, I'm fairly sure you are security." Years ago. So I usually go for all those options. It's just fun to hear. Them. Rat hosts. Then a single broad spectrum cure was developed to treat them all. Mm -hmm. Very satisfying work for many decades. Now, please tell me you are authorized to release me from the lab. Absolutely, I need a new mayor. Uh, I am so authorized. You are released. Superb. I had almost given up all hope of leaving here. I'll open the door for you. Hooray! Hell yeah. Can we go? Can we go? Do Since I have to go you are a Volt nope. representative, I entrust you with the broad spectrum cure I developed. If you have an equivalent to my digital Hippocratic Oath, please use it quickly to prevent any undue suffering. However, use it on myself. There is only one dose left, and I can no longer make any more. If that is all, I am most eager to leave. Thanks for the cure. It is my hope that this cure finds its way to someone who needs it. Hopefully now, I can properly further my scientific research. 
since my job here is done, I think I will follow you out. Yes, I need you to do science at one of my settlements. Uh, Kirk says, on one of my playthroughs, I made the mistake of using kill all instead of kill all hostile in Vault 81. It's <laughs> good not to be stuck in the quarantine. Killed all the Vault 81 people in the bare rooms behind the windows. Are those the actual NPCs, or are they copies of the NPCs, though? Uh, Simp Curie is my favorite vanilla companion, says Nick Carter, and... I can see why. I agree with you there. She's a pretty good companion. Very powerful as well. Oh, wait. Synth Curie, did you say? Oh, okay. Robot Curie is way more powerful. I like both Curies. I wish they did, they did more with a whole, like, you putting a robot into a synth body, though. Because the game treats it very much as like, oh, she's just a person now. It's like, well, no. She's a synth, and no, she's a robot. Oh, and I don't think she's a companion yet, is she? No, I think she's following me, so I can't I dump my equipment into her just yet. You're going to be a regular around here. Over the years. Ba, 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 ba. Uh, Eric says, You do have the small window during dialogue with the doctor. He used the cure after agreeing to give it to Austin, and the quest will act as normal. Oh. Well, that's uh, an oversight. Hmm. Always looking for tools. I heard he'll pick caps well, we're going to do some science. Quest, we travel extensively and collect data. We're going to try and pull that off. Okay, so it's the Overseer and the Teachers and Alex were dead when I returned to Vault 81. Okay, so it's, it uses the actual NPCs in those rooms there. Well, Canuck, I hope you learned a valuable lesson. Don't murder everything with God powers, as tempting as it may be. Stay safe, sir. Give me my action points back. Right. Inferno is just down here. We're gonna jump if it lets me. Nope. There we go. Saved like three seconds. Okay, I'm gonna save here. I uh, just make sure you save first. I uh, have to break away from the dialogue cameras if I remember correctly. Okay. Hello, Doctor Forsyth. The cure. You found it. Uh huh. Okay. So, I agree to give it to Austin, and then I break out and give it to myself? Or do I have to wait until something else? This is for science. We're seeing how to cheat the game. Is that it? How is Austin doing? How is Austin doing? Do you think he'll survive the cure? He's been unconscious since shortly after you left. Hmm, okay. So we're going to give it to Austin, and then I'll see if I can break out and use it myself. Here, take the cure, and use it on the boy. Only one dose? Okay. Uh, so I still have it. I hope this works. If it doesn't, there won't be anything to analyze to try again. Let's hope this works. I heard you when you returned. <laughs> <laughs> it's so silly. <laughs> what are you injecting him with? And where are you injecting it? It shouldn't be long. <laughs> where, where am I? You're in the God. clinic. That's you were so really stupid. Sick, I Austin. love it. <laughs> Our visitor from the Commonwealth saved your life. I just really? saved your life. Mm -hmm. Gee, thanks, mister. I was worried to death about you, Austin. What got into your fool head? Going into a place like that. Nothing exciting ever happened to you. I just <laughs> Thank you, Eric. That, that, that's there. so stupid. I well, love if it. If it hadn't been for our friend here, you might have died. Thank you. I know you made sacrifices to help him. I know Dr. Pinsky will be grateful. For my part, I'd like to give you the syringe. Oh, yes. I had it give for me. years and never really had a use for it. She's not the only one. The whole vault is thankful. I'd like to give you a room here in the vault. A place you can call your own. It's in the main hall. On the left, as you get off the elevator. Once again, thank you. Can I, go I hope you enjoy your accommodation. I wanted to say thank you again for what you did for Austin. You've opened a lot of eyes around here, including my own. I 
had no idea of the dangers Vault Tech had hidden away. I did not have time to read to all that stuff that just popped up. I can't up believe so many died just behind our walls. Think about pre war seeds. Whatever Vault Tech had planned, it failed and took their entire staff out with it. No arguments here. I hate to think of what they had planned for us. But on the good side, you made a real impression on our anti Commonwealth people. They're realizing outsiders really can be trusted and do more good than just providing resources. You'll always be welcome here. And I hope you make a habit of visiting. Having a trusted outsider would help serve as a reminder that the Commonwealth isn't something to fear and avoid. See, this always bugged me in the base game. You, you help out the vaults, normally quite early in your playthrough generally. Especially if you're playing SS2. Oh, I see what Kira has to say. I believe it's customary to thank you for your role in saving me. My entire life has... So now I'm... Mm -hmm. Fantastic. So, as I was saying, they thank you, they're like, hey, come back to the vault anytime you want. And you come back and there's nothing to do here. Yeah, you have a room, but there's no more quests. Uh, there's nothing really to do. Everybody says the same thing. And that felt kind of lame. So that's part of the reason uh, why I gave Mansfield the Radiant Quest. I fear you may need a reboot. Even though you can... You know, once you recruit him, he doesn't give those anymore. But I will hint that there is something else we want to do with this vault at a certain point, so hopefully look forward to that. We'll see. After the bombs, the common... But surely then, it was going to skip this. Everyone knows the dialogue to recruit her. Yes. Come along, then. Excellent. We must imp uh, Piper. Oh, yeah, we had Piper. Uh, technically, she's in charge of Sanctuary, so let's send her back there. Oh, and let's give hey. Curie do my junk. Hello, Blade Killer. Welcome. We, we learnt a valuable life hack that you can use in in Fallout 4. Where you can use the uh, Molrek cure on yourself, but you've already selected the option to hand it over, so you can kind of cheat the game and cure yourself, but do the good option at the same time. Very cheeky. Very funny. I never knew about that. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Upload Piper? Question mark. Did I say something weird? <laughs> it's quite possible. Uh, let's not give those grenades. Okay, that should do for now. From me? Thank you, Curie. Now we need to go found a settlement somewhere and maybe grab some supplies so I can build a recruitment beacon. Although, it does look like shortly I will be calling it for the night. As we're almost at 11pm for me. And I do still have some work to do tonight. Uh, as in, take junk and weapons from her. Oh, I get you. Uh, she'll be fine. We'll be heading back to Sanctuary at a certain point. And I, <laughs> I'm sure everyone's noticed I'm not really playing the game if properly dark, in terms of uh, keeping my gear up to date and getting good equipment. Ba -ba -ba. You really do have a talent for finding trouble. I guess we could fill her up, uh, but yeah, we're good for now. Let's grab some supplies from. Hmm. Where might have what we need? Let's see. Maybe Sunshine. Let's see if Sunshine's got enough for us to build a small power generator. And if it does, uh, we'll grab what we need. And also a uh, recruitment beacon. And I'm fairly sure I've got some junk on me as well, so maybe that'll be enough. Okay, so stuff's happening at HQ. Fantastic. The power. Oh, we, we don't have enough to build a generator. We need to scrap some rubber. There's got to be some tires around here somewhere. Unless they've all been removed. Well, maybe Sanctuary is the best bet then. Okay, so you need rubber gear, copper, ceramic. Barely sure most of that I'm carrying right now. I'm guessing there's no random tires around for me to scrap. Hmm.
Okay, let's head back to Sanctuary then. First, we'll just check the workbench here and see if there's any materials we can take with us. Transfer. Okay, copper. Those you all need some of that. Ceramic. Steel. 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 Uh, more steel. Don't know if we need cloth. Steel, steel, steel. Is okay. this worth To Sanctuary. Anything? But I will say, we're probably going to wrap up soon. So if any, anyone wants any more questions to squeeze in before I have to disappear, it can be about SS2, it can be about uh, the Bard project that we're working on right now, or it can just be anything in general. And now is the time to ask it, because very shortly we will be calling it for the night. Okay, we can build a generator, so... Uh, let's scrap this. And grab some... Oh, hello. Yeah. Oh, it's a visiting guy. I thought we had a new settler, but nope. Oh, that's not what to do. I wanted to transfer. Okay. I want to go to junk. Okay, some copper, some steel. Ah, I'll grab that this fine, why not? And where is... The rubber. Okay, we don't need that much. Yeah, that should be enough. Okay. Oh, come on, just leave it. Um... Why can't we build that? Uh oh, we've reached our build limit, okay. <laughs> But technically, okay, I think we have enough in our inventory to build something if we travel to a new settlement. Yeah. So where should we build up? Um, okay, we still need to help Ten Pines. Uh, let's go build up uh, Oberlin Station. They're going to be a power facility, even though it makes sense more for them to be a farm. But we need power right now. Okay, generator. Oop. Oh, damn it. Slightly not enough copper and ceramic. And I got a feeling we're not going to find that here, but let's... Nope. We have uh, some cans we can scrap. That's not going to give us what we want. Damn, 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 damn. Copper and ceramic. <laughs> I mean, we probably could find some if we just ran to a location, like, over here, but I'm lazy, so... Back to Sanctuary, we need copper and ceramic. Copper and ceramic. And then we'll build a recruitment beacon, and then, uh... Get a few settlers there. And then next time we shall put Curie in charge, and she can be mayor, and build a lovely city, and we'll start transferring some power back to the HQ. That is the plan. Okay, so we needed... Uh, copper and ceramic. What has copper? Copper, copper, copper. Steel. Okay, let's grab that ceramic just in case we need more. Okay, one, two, three. That should be enough, I think. I should have... I should have, uh... Actually paid attention to the numbers, but I think that's enough. I cross my fingers. Okay. There we go. Beautiful. Although now I'm kind of thinking... If we put Cure in charge and just built a, uh... Uh, what you call it, a, um, a city planning desk here. Part of the city plan probably would have a what I just built, so uh, maybe that was a waste of time. <laughs> Either way, uh, that is where we're going to call it here for today. Unless anyone has a quick question they want to sneak in there. Now, I do plan to stream next week. I don't think anything's going to come up to uh, stop that from happening. I almost considered not streaming today because, as I said, I do have some work to do because we're still 
busy working away on the uh, Skyrim Bard project. But uh, getting very close. Most people have uh, most of the work done that they need to do. I'm very close myself. All the important writing is done. But there's always tiny extra bits of writing. There's, there's always those extra bits. So that's what I'm working on right now. And uh, we're very close to getting uh, getting something that I think you could play all the way through. Still not technically finished, but gosh, it's getting close. And I can't wait to start showing previews to everyone. Just uh, screenshots or maybe even short videos. It's, it's going to be a good one. So let's uh, save our game here. And I think if we close out of the game, I think that solves my problem of... Um, Fallout forgetting which screen it's meant to be streaming to. But yes, uh, calling it there for today. Thank you very much for always just tuning in. I'm very sorry I didn't do it last week, but uh, I think you guys would rather I work on the very, very cool thing than, than stream the, the silly, silly Fallout game. We've all played that before. And it's not as if someone else on the team doesn't stream it and do a much better job than I do. But regardless, I still appreciate you tuning in and watching my silly playthrough. And hopefully you learned something. I learned that we can cheat the mole rat's cure. I think that's the most important thing we learned uh, during the stream. So thank you very much, Erica. That, that is knowledge that will be in my head forever now. But I'm, I am curious whether or not um, some of the, uh, the unofficial patches or other similar mods fix that. Because that seems like a big oversight. But maybe they take the same philosophy of, well... If you're clever enough to find that that oversight and take advantage of it, you, you kind of deserve to uh, to be able to use that sort of uh, exploit. Oh, a sneaky fish Evans are snooking. Do you do any singing in the Bard Project? Uh, hmm, uh, no. <laughs> Unless um, we have a VA who can't fill the role, I'm fairly sure I'm not doing any singing this time around. But never say never, you never know. I will be uh, voicing at least one familiar character, and I may be voicing other less familiar characters. But this time around, for sure, we have a much bigger cast, and therefore, it can't be me and Kobus voicing everyone. So we definitely have some more people. Some of them will be uh, will be familiar voices from SS2, perhaps, and some of them will be new voices. Some of them may be familiar from other things. You'll just have to wait and see. But we are. Uh, very excited that this time around we can actually bring in more talented people. And that's all because people were very, very generous, I think, and bought East Empire. I didn't expect that to get as good as a uh, reception as it did. But because people were generous and bought it, and that's money that went to King of Creations, and we put it right back into modding so that we can go do cool things and have an even bigger cast in our next project and do more interesting things. Uh, create more assets, create more more areas in the game, so on and so forth. So, uh, yeah, look forward to that. We, we've spared no expense. We've uh, put a lot of effort into our, our current project. Uh, oh, we're gonna we're gonna end with a fun fact from America. Fun facts like the mole rat disease cure are worth sharing. Pretty sure I learned that from uh, from. Yeah, pretty sure I learned it from It's Jabo, who is a streamer and speedrunner. Well, thank you very much, It's Jabo. I'm assuming I'm saying that correct, or maybe wrong, who knows. But uh, that is, that's that's good collective knowledge to share around. So um, we, we've done we've done good. We've contributed to the whole. <laughs> I'm not going to keep yet by asking a question. Good luck with the work. Good night. Thank you, Erica. And good night to everyone else, as always. Thank you very much for tuning in, and see you next week. <laughs>